Mediterranean ports have a color of their own. It's as though the buildings have been painted to reflect various shades of Mediterranean sunlight. The water, too, changes color with the changing light. Pale blue and turquoise turn to apricot and deep purple. On land, the orange and ochres at midday become cinnamon and honey with the setting sun. Such beauty makes it difficult to believe that 60 years ago, war cast a shadow over Mediterranean ports. Falling bombs groaned from the sky, and in the harbors, the sea had showered in the blast from underwater mines. A mine is an unseen menace, a psychological torment, a sudden death. During World War II, it was the minesweepers who searched for mines, who sailed into the darkness to sweep and clear the harbors of this unseen terror. One such minesweeper was the gallant HMS Eddy. HMS Eddy was a drifter built by Alexander Hall and Company in Aberdeen, Scotland, in 1918. She was a muscle-bound little ship. She had pulled port duty in the United Kingdom until the outbreak of World War II, when she sailed to Malta and was rigged for minesweeping duties in Grand Harbor. She was an unheralded little ship whose claim to glory lay in the dangerous duty she did night after night. On May 26, 1942, Eddie herself hit a mine and sank. 